Hi YouTube, my name is Octavia. I am 31 years old. I am currently living in Manhattan, Kansas. I know, where is that? It is in the middle of nowhere. However, I have to make the best of the situation. <laughs> I am a military spouse and I was trying to find something to do to take up some extra time during the day. So I figured I would start a YouTube channel and the channel is going to be called Bama Girls Cafe. Now, I know people are saying, why Bama Girls Cafe? Because I am a Bama girl. I am from Alabama, Roll Tide, and I love to cook. I've been cooking since before I could remember. Um, food is a passion for me and my family. Most of my life has been centered around the kitchen and cooking and reading recipes and um, just my love for food started at a really young age. I can remember being about eight or nine years old. One of my aunts took me into the kitchen and she decided to show me how to fry fish. And that was something I'll never forget because I was scared as you know what because of the hot grease. I had always been told grease is hot, it burns. I was terrified but I fried that fish honey and I've been frying it since. Um, <laughs> Um, when I was about 18, I left Mobile and I traveled and I did a couple things and then I returned home and I decided to go to culinary school. Now, most people say culinary school. Hmm. Yes, culinary school. It wasn't one of those things where, you know, oh, I wanted to be a top chef. I really enjoyed cooking and I knew that it was something that I would probably spend the rest of my life doing because I had been so involved in it growing up. I can remember on um, holidays, we didn't have a chopper back then, we had hand choppers. My grandmother and my aunts would give us all celery, bell pepper, and onion. I, I knew what the trinity was before I could, you know, <laughs> multiply, which is bell pepper, onion, <laughs> and celery. So that should tell you how long I've been in the kitchen cooking. Um, I can remember sitting on the porch of my grandmother shelling peas and sometimes standing in the kitchen next to her on a bucket. She had these big, big buckets and um, she would store like cornmeal and flour and sugar, whatever products that she had she would store in those, those buckets and I would stand on the bucket at the stove with her and watch her cook. And um, it was one of those things that it's one of those things that's really close to my heart because I think the real passion for cooking came from my grandmother and my mother because I was with them all the time and my grandfather too he can make some hot world of cornbread and make your toes curl up girl but <laughs> enough about that um, what the whole point of this channel is I want to get people back in the kitchen cooking the channel is going to be kid friendly and there might be some adult content but I will warn you prior to but my whole goal is to get you back in the kitchen cooking easy recipes simple home style recipes that will take no more than 20 or 30 minutes and you're done now some of them are going to be a little longer but you know we'll break those videos up and we'll go through them step by step but you know I want you to bring your kids into the kitchen and let them participate because I think a lot of times People are so rushed that they don't bring their kids in the kitchen and you know, you they are 16 to 17 and they can't cook, they go off to college, they're eating canned food. I mean, my friends, some of them really struggled when they left to go off to school. Not me, I was prepared. So, <laughs> I think it's important that we get back to the basics of cooking and bringing the children and husbands and friends and families into the kitchen and cooking and talking and really getting back to the basis of food. Um, I don't have any kids so oftentimes I will kidnap people and their children and <laughs> give them cooking lessons and feed them. I love to feed people. Like seriously. I will feed you. Okay? But let's not go there. But I do spend a lot of my life in the kitchen. Um, not because I'm forced to, because I love to. I do some private catering here and there. Not much lately, but um, I just want you guys to, you know, tune in. If you like this video, thumbs up, like, and subscribe. And also, I'm going to be doing a giveaway in about two weeks. And I'm hoping that I can at least get 100 subscribers in the next two weeks. 
So I'm going to do a giveaway. And the giveaway is going to be um, it is a container of salt. Now people say, what am I going to do with salt? Well, this is not your everyday salt. This salt is a variety, it's small variety packs of different salts. Some of them are like peppercorn, um, one is a French onion salt. And these salts are really good for like grilling, for fish. Every salt in here is flavored. And it's really good with like fish, um, chicken, steak. So I'm sure whoever wins that will enjoy it. Let me have a sip of tea. And I look forward to seeing more of you guys. Um, like I said, I will have a video up by the end of next week. I'm working on it. So please, you know, hang out. Um, look at my channel. I will list my Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter in the box below. And if you have any ideas of any recipes that you would like to see on the channel, you know, Comment and subscribe and let's get to talking about food, you know, easy, quick recipes. A lot of the recipes are going to be southern based because I am southern. And, you know, I'm going to, you know, hit different corners of the country, you know, different foods. Um, talk about a little bit of different wines and, you know, how to season, how to prep. You know, I, I really want to get the conversation about food moving, especially with my... 30 to 20 something chicks because a lot of y'all know y'all don't cook You ought to be ashamed of yourself, but I'm not here to judge. I just want to bring you guys into the love of food And thank you guys for um, watching Remember to like and subscribe thumbs up this video and like I said, I will be doing a giveaway in two weeks To some of my first subscribers. So let's get this thing Rolling. Have a good day. Mm.